The CDC is now asking the U.S. Justice Department to go to court and appeal the ruling that earlier this week got rid of the federal travel mask mandate. Michael George tonight with the very latest. The Department of Justice appealed a Florida judge's ruling striking down the federal mask mandate for airplanes and other mass transit. The CDC made the request, calling its masking order both lawful and necessary for public health. Former CDC Director Tom Frieden and other health experts are alarmed that while masks are coming down, COVID-19 case numbers are going up. The biggest concern is what's going to happen in the coming months? What if yes. we have a more dangerous variant that's deadly, that gets away from our vaccine-induced immunity? The public is divided over the judge's ruling overturning that mandate. I think it's wonderful. In fact, I'm ecstatic. I'm not happy about it, as you can see. I still have my mask. A new poll finds 56% of Americans still support the transportation mask requirement. 24% are opposed. In New York, masks are now optional on commuter train lines, but they're still required on city subways. During the rush hour commute, most New Yorkers were masked up, and city health officials want that to continue. Especially when you don't know the vaccination status of those around you, but really in all indoor settings, wear a high filtration mask. Along with confusion about masks, many Americans are undecided about getting a second vaccine booster. The CDC met with outside experts Wednesday afternoon to discuss further guidance on who should get that fourth shot. Michael George, CBS News, New York.